In this video, I'm gonna be going over the top programming languages for cybersecurity. Now, you don't need to know programming to get into cybersecurity unless you wanna go say application security. There are tons of different languages and it can be kinda of hard to navigate. So I put together this video to help navigate the world of programming in cybersecurity and which ones would be useful to know along with why they would be useful. I have links below for all of these on the best classes to learn these languages, so check that out. Code Academy is a really good place to learn these also. First cybersecurity programming language is going to be JavaScript. JavaScript is really widely known across the entire world, and if you want to work with cookies, manipulation of event handlers, or perform cross-site scripting, JavaScript is where you're going to want to head to. Also, smash that like button just for the cat. Python is the next one on this list and it's pretty easy to learn. It is great for automating repetitive tasks. It can be added to any system or server and there are tons of online education about this. There is a Google Coursera IT and automation course, which would be useful if you're wanting to get in this field. There's also a Python for everyone course hosted on Coursera. Link is below in the description if you want to check that out. The next one is C and C++ and these are really important languages. If you want to go deep into programming, you're going to need to know in cybersecurity. C and C++ provide a low level access to IT processes such as system processing and RAM. These are often exploited by hackers. The programming language C is often the backbone of many operating systems. So if you know C in this field, then the opportunities are unlimited and you could probably ask for a lot of money. It's also very compact and very versatile and is used in many things such as authentication, information processing, and socket networking. And C++ is largely based on the source code of C. And a lot of cybersecurity programs are created in C++. So learning C++ can definitely give you an advantage in the job market. The next one is HTML. And I'm very familiar with HTML. It's a markup language and it's not very difficult to learn. You could probably learn it in a solid two weeks, but it's basically kind of like the size of paragraphs when you see a web page. However, that doesn't mean it's not easily exploitable because it is. Like JavaScript, HTML can be injected into web pages to create a cross-site scripting attack. Content spoofing can often be done with injecting HTML, which means that it shows a false web page to the user and can give them false information to what they actually want. The next cybersecurity programming language to learn would be SQL. This is also not a hard language to learn. You can learn it in the data analytics, Google certifications. I do have a review here, really good course to learn. Go through this course and you should have a good enough base knowledge to do some projects on that and put that on your resume for those looking for a job. SQL or SQL is used for the management of databases. And this makes it extremely prone to attacks because SQL is also used for computer management and recovery. A popular attack done with SQL is SQL injection attack where a user tries to manipulate the database using certain commands to either retrieve data or just kind of take down the entire database. Those are the top programming languages in cybersecurity. If you know any more, please leave a comment below and smash that like button. And I also have tons of other videos on cybersecurity, cybersecurity careers, how to get a job in cybersecurity, and all of that fun sort. So check that out.